what's the point? Nope, you're totally right. As a male you do have to put an effort in seeking someone, being confident and having integrity so that women feel safe around you. Even having your own style and caring about your appearance makes a big difference too. And sure, you could get lucky and meet a girl that pursues you instead, but that doesn't always work out either. I found my current girlfriend through dating apps and am pretty happy with the relationship we have. It seems to be a much healthier and caring one than what I've had in the past at least. And I did in fact find her from using dating apps and constantly talking to girls that made me feel bad about myself, going on dates that just didn't work out mutually, and often feeling depressed and very lonely. But doing nothing means nothing will happen. By the way, just before I found her I was intending on starting to go to clubs and group events more to work on talking to people better and possibly finding someone that way. I was also considering on paying a professional to take better photos of me and to get help with my dating profiles. Don't give up. So long as you have the right intentions, there is always something more you can do and ways to be better for someone else that will improve your chances. In this case the issue is you're trying too hard with a method that isn't efficient dating apps are absolute, utter fucking dog shit don't waste your time unless you are very tall very fit very handsome and have very good pictures even then, you're probably gonna need to be extremely charismatic on top of that otherwise it's a complete waste of your energy. I'm sorry to say it, but I went through the same process you did before I took it to heart you have to find co-ed groups to socialize and find some sort of hobby or club with a healthy mix don't go into it specifically hitting on every girl, but learn to socialize in those spaces and be fun to be around. Women gravitate to the men in these groups who other people like and who are open and fun and easy to be around. Once you've got rapport with people, the rest is easy easier the hardest part is just getting your foot in the door getting women to think you're safe and enjoyable to hang out with that's why these social groups are so good because it's naturally conducive to meeting people that way. I agree with you. I'm a girl and everyone knows that online dating is favorable towards the female community, but I am still having issues finding someone. Men I've matched with are flaky, inconsistent and they don't make effort. I know men would say the same about the female population as well. Everyone is just overwhelmed with options and no one wants to put much effort because you will just meet your next someone when you start swiping again. I would say take a break from online dating since it looks like you reach or close to reaching your breaking point. Hey handsome why don't you text me huh? To get off or owe to something. Or not. Nah. Online dating is complete bollocks. As someone who is on the autistic spectrum, I am happier staying single over online stuff. I like why people have issues online dating I've met plenty of people and my current soon to be wife is from a app. I know how you feel I never get anyone to even talk I can't be bothered anymore. I guess you weren't talking about this. 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 I know exactly how you feel that's why I dispatched the game out myself though it's not worth it. I know exactly how you feel that's why I dispatched the game out myself though it's not worth it. I tell you this I found my wife on Occupid and it was fast, but I end up not happy with her she also cheated on me while she is working abroad. Now I regret this psycho in my life. People on a dating site has life issues, me included I was broken hearted back then and broke, hoping to find it in an easy way. Additionally dating app make dating game like a competition it's like buying on online shop, but they can reject customers. A very choosy store I would say. This make people using that app not to be content. It has a bad effect on people. So I recommend still follow the old ways priorities yourself, and have courage to mingle with girls on your realm. Make sure that person isn't influenced by this new trend. I feel this heavily man plus with all the catfish scammers it gets way worse I had plenty of those one of them hacked into my bank account, and put me 300 USD in debt recently. I've actually just given up on dating completely because it happens so often now. These videos will help you you to dot berk uv8 vu lpkn 4c equals w2 eu erca 7 fthh ru to dot bd2 dot jss nm oxy equals obo2 xeg ot jv1 f58c. I'm nearly 60 and I feel ya. Online dating sucks. I've been married, divorced, kids are grown. I don't want to get married again, but I don't want ons, fwb, or hookups. I want to go out on dates and get to know someone build a connection before having sex. Guys just want to fuck, especially with an older woman like me. It must be on their sexual bucket list. I'm about to give up too. They want to rush into sex, but then go with the flow when it comes to labels or being monogamous. They also don't want to use condoms, which is a deal breaker for me. Real immature, selfish, impatient and irresponsible.